So Union Budget 2019 uh, is like a vision statement of government for next 5 to 10 years. In budget, government has given cognizance to all issues which are important to ensure long-term sustainable growth of the country. So thought process is there, we need to see how well and effectively it is put into action. On banking and finance front, uh, government has announced a recapitalization package of 70,000 crores to public sector banks. It's a big relief to public sector banks. With this, uh, most of the public sector banks will be out of PCA framework. They will get necessary growth capital for onwards lending and funding next capex cycle. For NBFCs, the government has announced partial credit guarantee scheme, uh, wherein public sector banks can buy high quality rated assets of NBFCs. This will cover their initial losses of 10%. So, in my view, this is, has limited value. As few NBFCs who are well managed and willing to sell their portfolio would be able to take benefit of this scheme. Also, the scheme is for six months, which means uh, PSBs would be largely interested in buying uh, short term retail assets. On the regulatory side, uh, FPI's foreign portfolio investors have been allowed to invest in debt papers issued by NBFCs. It's a positive move and would open more funding avenues for NBFCs. Reserve Bank of India on budget day has also announced liquidity easing measures for uh, public sector banks, uh, which would create more liquidity for onward lending to NBFCs. We need to see how soon and effect effectively it's put into action. In direct taxes also, there have been a uh, few positive announcements for NBFCs, uh, like interest earned by NBFCs on sub standard assets would be taxed on uh, receipt basis rather than accrual basis. Additional deduction of 150,000 affordable housing is a welcome change and should create more demand for housing projects. Overall, government has issued, announced a lot of measures for NBFCs, but in my view, uh, these measures would not be able to address current situation uh, and, has, and has limited value. Uh, having said this, uh, by taking these measures and uh, announcing re recapitalization package for public sector banks, uh, government has given strong indication that they want to ensure sufficient credit inflows into market this year. Thank you.